Mind if I join you? Yes. Is there something wrong with your hearing? You're just a nerve, because I'm getting so close. I'm close enough to realise that you haven't had a shower for some time. A bit lacking in facilities with current digs. What I could do with is a nice bed, an old bath, and someone to scrub me back for me. You're invading my personal space, if you don't mind. I do. If I demand a pint. A pint of arsenic, maybe. Excuse me. <sighs> Move. Make me. Go on. I like a bird with a bit of spirit. You make my flesh crawl. Go on, talk dirty again. Or are you saving it for Grandad over here? Grandad, I've had Go on, then, in front of all these people. Go on. Is that not a good move? Do you want to take it outside? That's if your pacemaker's up to it. No, he doesn't, do you, Dad? Come on, then. Hey, hey. Less of the raging testosterone and more peaceful coexistence, please. Shut it, Nancy boy. Look, we don't do homophobia in this bar. Probably best that you find somewhere more bigot-friendly to do your drinking. You weren't the man. Sorry, love. And you thought it was your lucky day, eh? I'd watch you back if I were you. See ya. Someone should really make him do something about that jacket. He does seem to have been dogging my footsteps recently. Must be your animal magnetism. Maybe you should be more choosy about the company you keep. You've been such a gentleman, Tom. Please, let me buy you a drink. I don't think so. Take care of yourself.